Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel, today, we are going to know some of the basic things, to do right after installing Windows Server 2019. These things you can do before preparing your server, also even before installing Windows Server 2019 Active Directory. The first step immediately after installing, the operating system is, rename the server. Changing the name of the server is the first thing after the installation process for Windows, and you must give it a unique name, to facilitate access and contact with it. I will show the desktop icons, immediately after installing Windows Server 2019, you will find that your desktop is empty. Click the right mouse button, and from the menu, choose Personalize. From the left menu, select Themes and then click on desktop icon settings. Select the icons you want to show on your desktop, then click the OK button. To change the server name, right click on this PC, and select properties. From the section on computer name settings, click on change settings. Click on the Change button, then in the specified place to write the name of the computer, type the name you want, and it must be a name that is not on the same network. After pressing the OK button, you will be asked to reboot the server, but before restarting, write a description computer to distinguish the server from the rest of the computers. After that, agree to restart the computer in order, to save the new name of the server. The second step, set the time zone to your applicable time zone. Adjusting the time and date according to the time zone, is one of the important things to, make the server work in an appropriate system, for the country in which it is operating. Go to the settings, and then press the time and language, to set the time zone and also to adjust the time and date if necessary. Be sure to adjust the time, to suit the workplace, because you will get in trouble if you don't do that. We then move on to the third step, which is to assign a static IP address to the server. One of the basic steps before, installing Active Directory is for the server to have its own IP address. Click on the network card, and enter the settings, and assign a static IP address, I do not need to explain how, everyone knows how to set an IP on a computer. The last step. It is install Windows Server 2019 updates, and this step is definitely a must. Everyone knows that updates must be made continuously, to keep the server from any attacks or hackers, the updates contain a lot of security for the server. Go to Settings, then choose Update and Security. Then click on Check for Updates, and let it do the available updates, with the need to do the update regularly later. The update process will take some time, depending on the speed of the internet, and also the capabilities of the server, leave it until it finishes the updates. The server will then be a device to install Active Directory after completing the update. In the upcoming videos, I will follow with you how to build a server, that you can rely on in organizing work. Thank you for watching, and I hope subscribe to my channel, thank you.